Welcome back to the channel, everyone. So uh, today, man, if you guys haven't kept up with my IG channel, you probably don't know, right? So uh, I'm really excited today because we're putting a lot of really cool interior parts and some exterior parts on the car. Uh, they are carbon fiber and I'm really, really digging them. So um, let's turn the camera real quick and I'll show you guys what we have. So as you guys can see, the SSRs are coming together. Uh, I'm thinking those are looking really clean. I don't know if you, I don't know how well this will show up, but with the lips are polished at this point, uh, I've just put the bolts in. Uh, we haven't actually tightened those down yet. So uh, that, that's coming along, along real, really nice. Uh, of course, we've got more bolts are sitting in here, but uh, this is what we're doing today. So uh, this is a custom full carbon fiber steering wheel uh, with Alcantara and uh, the BMW tricolor stitching. I'm really, really excited about this steering wheel, guys. Uh, as you guys can see, we have carbon fiber shift paddles that we've added as well, too. Um, and so we've got to get it swapped out um, as well, as we do have some additional carbon fiber parts here. Uh, these will be going in here shortly as well, too. We might just go ahead and do this in the same video. Sweet carbon fiber kidney grills, as well as we've got now true carbon fiber mirror caps, which are, are really, really nice. Uh, the ones that I've had on the, on the car for, I mean, the last what, two years are, I've been, you know, just kind of a carbon fiber style. I uh, don't look as clean. So uh, this is super, super exciting for me. Um, as you guys can see, I've already got the trunk popped. I've went ahead and uh, disconnected the battery, currently popped out the airbag. I don't want to go through too much of this because I've done at this point three steering, well, this will be the third steering wheel on the channel. So uh, I don't want to go through all of this, but want to just kind of show you guys what we're going to what we're what we're kind of working on today uh so i will be back with you guys here shortly just like that the new wheel is installed uh and we're going to go ahead and put in our temporary normal airbag um we do i do have a alcantara airbag to come that's uh that's on the way so uh it'll go with the nice alcantara on the side so as you can see my side um, handles basically have Alcantara flat bottom here. Uh, this wheel just looks really, really nice and clean. So I'm going to get the airbag on real quick uh, and we'll uh, start on some of the other mods. There we go. Airbag installed and man, that thing is beautiful. So now that the steering wheel's done, uh, the next thing I'm going to do is get rid of these fake carbon fiber, you know, um, mirror caps. So again, I already have a YouTube video on the channel knocking this out, so I'm not going to bore you with that. Uh, there will be links in the video description how to how to do this. But I'm going to go ahead and get those swapped out, and then we'll go ahead and swap out the kidney grills as well, too. Okay, we got one carbon fiber mirror installed, and man, that looks that looks gorgeous, guys. So uh, just for reference here, we're going to take a look over at the old at the bench here. This, of course, is your your fake carbon fiber compared to that real carbon fiber. And I don't know, hopefully this is showing up properly in 4K for us, but there is a there is a drastic difference there in quality. I mean, of course this is fake, but just it, this, this looks excellent. Uh, I can tell you that uh, fitment on it was perfect as well too. So uh, yeah, let's get the next one slapped on. Well, now we have both side mirrors done. Those look phenomenal. Uh, one part that I almost forgot that I had guys um, this is actually, this did not come with my whole carbon fiber shipment, but I did pick this up. Uh, this actually received, I think I received it a week or two ago. Uh, this was something that I purchased off of AliExpress and it is one of the carbon fiber um, shark tails. Uh, so this actually goes over your antenna cover or oh, I mean, it's a cover for your antenna here. So I can get this out uh, and there it is there. Of course, that looks phenomenal as well too. Very, very well made. Of course, it's a lot. It's a lot thinner of material uh, than what we've been dealing with the, uh, thus far with the, with the shipment. But very, very nice in quality. So we're gonna go ahead. It already comes with 3M tape here. I just finished cleaning off the uh, the, the antenna up there, and we're gonna go ahead and slap this on as well to just give us another carbon fiber feature on the car. So I'll get that knocked out, and then I'll uh, determine if I'm gonna go ahead and knock out these grills or not. So now we see carbon fiber shark tail, looks great. Uh, and we're gonna go ahead and pull off the grills. So, 
already got one pulled out. Uh, again, another video, YouTube video for you guys out here on how to do this. Uh, so we're just gonna go ahead and swap out these grills, no big deal. There we go. Super easy install there, guys. Looks beautiful. I mean, nothing wrong with just the, uh, the all black gloss car uh, kidney grills, but I can't say no to carbon fiber. So of course, there's the, the standard black. Again, nothing wrong with that, but uh, I'm really, really, really liking the look of this. So now I've got some decisions to make, right? Because I've considered getting a full carbon fiber front splitter. I've actually thought about actually swapping out um, the uh, side skirt extensions for carbon fiber, as well as doing a true, oh, well, this is just a gloss black, but doing a carbon fiber rear diffuser. We already had the M4 style, uh, you know, carbon fiber uh, spoiler there, but I, I really, really like these little updates here to the, to the BMW. And I will tell you, again, you guys drop a comment down in the video description, tell me what you think, but I am considering whole carbon fiber hood. So I'm just, I'm just gonna leave it at that. You guys let me know what you think I should do. But, but really, really liking the way this is looking. So we've got the new wheels on. It's been a few days. As you guys know, we've gone through this carbon fiber journey. We've got the carbon fiber grill, carbon fiber, true carbon fiber mirror caps, carbon fiber shark fin in the back now. We've always had the carbon fiber spoiler since, I mean, this has had that for three or four years now. Uh, we've got the new carbon fiber steering wheel installed. And the last little bit that we have for today is actually the new Turner Motorsport carbon fiber engine cover. So this engine cover is technically made for the F30. These are, this is just a little uh, bag of uh, grommets. So the little, little grommets that go right in here, the little rubber holders, as well as your emblem actually is included in the baggie. We're gonna flip that over there and just see that's what looks, that's what it looks like. So that looks so super clean. So shout out to Holland, uh, and I'll actually uh, link his um, IG uh, channel in the video description. But uh, man, he's, uh, he, he showed me this. Uh, very, very cool setup, looks insane on his car. So I'm excited to get this installed on mine. Um, so uh, let's get into this installation. One other thing that I did wanna point out, cause I, I have had people uh, as far as on um, IG uh, asking about the steering wheel. Um, with this steering wheel, you do have the availability to do the LED uh, shift lights, if that's something that you desire. I did not decide to go that route, okay? And there's a reason for for it. Uh, I, I thought that was really cool. Uh, it's a cool feature to have if you, if you want it. However, when it comes to my MHD gauges, I typically have them on my Android screen. Uh, that's usually what I use my Android screen for. I don't use it for, I don't, I, this car doesn't go on long trips or anything like that. So I don't really need it for navigation or anything like that. So it's always us usually my MHD gauges. But when it comes to the OBD2 port, uh, you're not able to split it more than once as far as for uh, that type of signal. So in other words, if I was going to run my MHD gauges, um, I wouldn't be able to run the LED shift light um, on the steering wheel as well too. So you had to choose, it was either one or the other. And in my opinion, it made more sense for me to be able to run my MHD gauges on the Android screen. So that is the reason why I decided not to do the LED display on the steering wheel. But uh, we'll jump into this install here shortly. I just want to kind of give you guys a quick look at that new engine cover. The only reason why I haven't installed it yet at this point is I do need to do a little bit of trimming. Um, and that's right here around uh, this section here. That's just because of my uh, catch can, my oil catch can uh, setup that I'm running. Um, and I say I, I need to do a little trimming. I may be able to get away with finding a little bit longer a heater hose for the catch can so that was again one of the reasons why i haven't done the install yet i think i'll play with that first before i have to modify this so um i will hopefully be able to it'll probably be a couple days but i will reconvene this video shortly
Guys, I can't finish out this video without letting you guys see the finished product. So that is the rear, the new carbon fiber steering wheel. I've got my uh, full Alcantara airbag now installed that came in later, as well as we went ahead and shift, uh, switched over the uh, the red uh, M buttons. But uh, man, that is so clean. I really like it. And for all the guys that are actually asking on um, IG as far as these carbon fiber parts, I'm actually working with the manufacturer, trying to determine if there was going to be enough interest to to offer these parts to the community. So I really not, I need I need you guys to to, to reach out uh, down in the comments. Let me know if you guys are really wanting to to pick up some of these carbon fiber parts because uh, it is something that I'm actually again working uh, with the manufacturer as well as working with uh, Beamer House Performance, trying to determine if this is something that that we would like to carry for the community. So uh, if you if you like it. Drop a like on this video and uh, put some comments down below. Okay guys, so I hope you guys are really liking all the carbon fiber goodies we're putting on the car, but unfortunately, we are not gonna be able to finish the uh, actual, the engine cover in this video. It's hard to see, but I've actually started work on removing the heater core and I, I'm just, I don't have the time to keep working on it. We're getting ready for vacation. So I wanna cut this video off here so that you guys can actually be able to see it and then we'll resume uh, the intake manifold or not the intake manifold, but the engine cover at a later time. So guys, if this is your first time to the channel, make sure you like and subscribe. Keep coming back for more content, guys. Um, other than that, everyone be safe and we'll catch you guys in the next video.